Hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Banjo Tooie. At last, um, I had a very, very long break, I suppose <laughs> you could call it. But um, I'm back now. You might as um, you might have noticed in I believe it was my last episode. Uh, there was actually quite a bit of raging, uh, <laughs> mainly because something with the with the emulator and the ROM glitched out, and it just I don't know. And so I was thinking to myself, was like thinking out loud while I was recording, and I already got the ice key, I must have, I don't know if I got that off screen or what, so if you guys don't know what the ice key is, it's here, <laughs> I mean, because <laughs> it's been so long and it's just like I really don't feel like going back and watching all of my videos, because I don't know, I just don't, like I watch my videos, but I don't really like to because I don't know, it's just weird. I don't like to hear my own voice, it's just stupid. But anyways, um But yeah, I was just raging. <laughs> thinking out loud, as usual. Hopefully this doesn't happen again. Come on, come on, no clungo fight, no clungo fight, no clungo fight. Alright, whew, alright, cool. Didn't give me some bullshit. <laughs> So maybe that won't happen again, I don't know. But, um, honestly I was looking over my last video that I uploaded to uh, see where I should continue, but I think I got the extra bubbles, I'm pretty sure I did in the last video. Um, I'm not completely sure. Actually, I think it's in um, a video that I haven't quite uploaded yet, because I only have like what is it? I have it pulled up on my other monitor. I only have like four minutes of footage left over. So it's like... <laughs> I have to record some more so I can actually make that into a full video. So, yeah. Alright. Oh, what the fuck? Invisible wall, dude. <laughs> Get out of here. Your shenanigans. Alright. Let me just come on over here. Don't care. <laughs> Get out of my way. You hoodlum. Alright. I don't know if I even got these or not on camera. Behind the waterfall. Nope, I haven't gotten this one yet. Okay. Well, that's good. It's a good thing I checked. I had a feeling I didn't. Alright. Alright, let's go through here. Well, let's get this son of a bitch. Come here. Come here, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> there's actually a specific thing that you can do with these stop and swap eggs um, in game wise wow banjo banjo kazooie's mysterious blue secret egg I wonder what it's what's inside <laughs> yes my reading skills are still horrible <laughs> so it's that's that hasn't changed at all so in like the last month because it's literally been like a month since I've recorded like that's how much footage that I shoot in like one sitting I shoot a shit ton of footage in one sitting usually. Okay, let's just get down here. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and go uh, hatch these eggs. Real quick. Because one of them holds a move. That I really, really want to show you guys because it's funny. <laughs> so. Yeah, I don't have it yet. Alright, cool. Ah, what am I doing? Alright. <laughs> Failure. Alright. And then we'll get back to political which mine. So we're just doing a little bit of minor backtracking. Um, I really want to go to Witchy World though. Like, I really don't feel like completing uh, Glitter Gulch Mine right now. Just because Glitter Gulch Mine, it really isn't one of my most liked, I guess, levels. I just don't like it that much. I don't know why. It just doesn't, it doesn't give me a hard on like Witchy World does. So it's, it's yeah. Alright, so if you come over here, it's actually pretty decently hidden. There's like a nice size egg with a crack in it. When you walk in, I think it's Heggy. Yeah, Heggy's Egg Shed. Clock. Heggy the Hen. Clock. Find special egg. Clock. Got both special Heggy eggs. Piece of cake, actually. Clock. Skinny bird. Heggy's hero. Clock. Throw them in nests. So, come over here. And there's actually one egg, as you can see at the top right. Now it's at the top left. We can't hatch that till later. So, yes. Clock, watch Heggy hatch. Actually, I really don't want to. 
Oh my god. You fat bitch, hurry up. Shit. <laughs> Come on. You can do it. There you go. Alright. Clock, special Heggy Award, homing eggs. Clock, very nice. Clock, go to Cheeto Code Room and enter homing to enable feature. That's actually really cool, but I'm not gonna do it just for the sake of it's just completely overpowered. It's really op. Alright. Clock, special Heggy Award, Briggle Bash, that's it. Yeah, Clock, plus B and B again for Skinny Bird Bash. Clock, so funny. So basically, what we got. If she'll let me move. Alright, it was this. Bam! Oh. Bam! <laughs> now, yes, these are split up pads. <laughs> no shit, Sherlock! But yeah, you won't be able to use these until World 3, so. Which is Witchy World. <laughs> so, yeah. Alright, let's go back to, um. Glitter Gulch Mine. Yeah. <sighs> you guys can hear the sadness in my voice. Alright. Now there's actually one move that we're missing from here, but I actually know where it is, and we're gonna be saving that for like the last jiggy that we get here. Um Honestly, dude, I have no clue what I'm actually gonna do in here. Um <laughs> uh, I guess we could go get trans transformed because I think we already did everything that we can with Mumbo, didn't we? And we also did uh, King Cole as well. So yeah, we're actually gonna go do that. We're gonna go get transformed, and hopefully we don't miss any thing that we're that is very important as our transformation. Um, basically, like these. Fuck you. All right. Basically, if I miss any of these right here, I have to go back into um. Like, if I see him as Banjo and Kazooie, like, after I've changed back as them, like, I have to go all the way back and transform again. So it's like, ugh. So it can be a really pain, really big pain in the ass sometimes. Wait. Did I... Oh, I didn't even talk to you yet. You have Globo want to give to Humba? Yes. Maybe. Not the only thing I want to give to Humba. Look at them titties. <laughs> Magic ready. Jump in one bubble. <laughs> All right. Now you'll notice with this game though, if you've ever like played both of these and you're just watching this for like a nostalgia factor or something, um, you'll actually notice that in Banjo Kazooie you really change into more living things, but in this game you change into like, like I don't know how to explain it. Like there's one level where you change into a washing machine. This one you're a t like you're like a little detonator thing. I don't even know what the hell this thing's called. But basically, the way this thing works is you can swim with it, of course. <laughs> now I'll go ahead and demonstrate to you what the attack is with this thing. You hit Oh dude, you hit B and you blow up. <laughs> but the thing is it also takes away from your life as well, so you might want to be careful. The only time that you can do that and not hurt yourself is when you do something like this. Which we will be going and exploring that later as the bear and the bird, so. Which with this thing, you you also got like a little bit of a jump distance as well, like a little bit of a jump boost. Because as you notice, he hops around to move. So. Which honestly, I don't really like that mechanic at all, but whatever. Um... I don't know, I just don't like, uh, I just don't like characters that hop to move around, like, I don't know, I just find it like a pain in the ass, especially when you're trying to be, like, precise. Let's see. Oh! Double jump. Oh! Double jump. <laughs> Alright. Wait. Shit, wrong side. No, I wasn't supposed to go to the train station. Ugh, there's nothing to blow up there. Now, I know there's, at, like, at least maybe four things to blow up as this, so, honestly, I've completely forgotten where, like, the other two are. I know, like, I don't know how to explain it. Alright, um, do we actually, yeah, we want to go to World Entry and Exit. So that way we can go to the other side of the train tracks, to that one room, so, yeah, yeah. Okay. This thing walks so slow. Yeah, this part. 
which is fuel storage. Yeah, yeah. All right. We're gonna come in here, and I believe there's actually something to blow up in here, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and notes as well. Damn. Okay. Bleep. I'm trapped in this mine by that block tunnel. Bleep. <laughs> oh shit. Come on now. See what I'm talking about. Oh, I hate it. Alright. See, now here's something that we can do is this form. Ah. Alright. <laughs> so now I can move along, you know. Now, I might actually cut the footage. Um, so I can figure out where those other places are that I gotta blow up. <laughs> like, look up, like, a map of the world or something, I don't know. Or look up, uh, I don't know, I gotta look something up to help me out with this, because this is just, I don't know, there's, like, because I really don't feel like finding something that I have to blow up, and then I have to, like, go and change, and then I gotta find it again. <laughs> So I really don't feel like doing that because I've had to do that throughout the years of playing this game and it pisses me off. So I think I'm actually going to cut the footage uh, here in a second to the next place that i got to blow up. So I'll see you guys there. Okay, and we're back as the bear and the bird. As you can see, I had to transform back. Like just a pure example of how much of a pain in the ass this level is. Um, I actually have to build drill this boulder so I can get to the next place. So, yeah. Alright, let's go back. Now this is, this is actually kind of the cool thing about this level is you can actually teleport inside Wumpa's Wigwam. So it's like, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so then we're going to transform back. Um, yeah. Alright. I'm sure this is not the only time that I'm going to have to transform back. I just want to hurry up and get this shit out of the way. Alright, get on the fucking thing. God, alright. Side mumbo skull. Alright. Like I some booty for Quebec. Like I some booty for Quebec. I do not know why. Alright, big boy. My name is Abaklau. B-O-K-L-A-U. Alright, yeah, right here. Ratch Midge. Alright. Now, I guess I'm gonna go ahead, but this is kind of a pain to do. I think I'm actually gonna blow this dude up. Oh, shit. Go away, motherfucker. Don't you dare. Go away! Alright, get this ginger. Alright, get the hell out. Get the hell out. Dude, get out. <laughs> dude! Oh my god. Fuck! Da! Die! <laughs> oh, I'm such a spaz. Alright. Alright. Onward to the next position. I will see you guys there. Okay, so I think that's actually just about it for now. I'm kind of tired of reading. <laughs> so, I think what I'm actually about to go do, because I know there's one Cheeto page and one Jiggy that I know that I can get right now. And, um... I'm actually gonna go get that shit, so... Yeah, yeah. Let's transform that. And I'm tired of hopping around, so... <sighs> Alright. <laughs> that transformation is such a buzzkill, dude. I'm serious. I hate that transformation. Alright. So we're gonna slide right on down here. Oop! Fuck you! Sack of shit! Alright. Now, it's a good thing we got extra bubbles, because we would have been fucked here, so... That's exactly what we're gonna do. So, there's this, like, little bird in here. Bird human. Over here, I need you to help me out of this frightful predicament. Who might you be? I'm Canary Mary. They, use me, they used to send me down to the mines to check for gas. If I died, they'd know it wasn't safe. Nice. I can think of more pleasant jobs. They just left me in here. I don't think I'll last much longer. Don't worry, I'll get Kazooie here to smash the cage open. If I must. I wonder if I can do it like this. Ah! Ah, you fucking scary bitch. Right. <laughs> Woohoo, I'm free. Yeah, you look. It's moments like this that make adventuring worthwhile. But she hasn't even gotten a Jiggy. Oh. Yeah, she's actually got a Jiggy and a Cheeto page. 
Actually, I don't think there's really anything in this room. But I'm gonna check it just in case. So, yeah, yo. Dun, 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 dun. And we gotta watch this long ass cutscene. It's just like, the shit like this, though, is like the only thing that I actually hate about this game. It's like the long fucking cutscenes like this. Stupid shit. Alright. Well, you'll see there's like this broken down minecart right there, right next to it. Wait, that's where I'm supposed to blow up. Right there, I just saw that shit, dude. You can't hide that from me. Get out of here. Actually, I do need some regular eggs. I don't need any feather. Well, I guess it's always good to be filled. Full. Bleh. Give me the grenade. No. Alright, whatever. I'll take the blue eggs as well. Yeah, like I said, I really don't think there's anything in here. I don't hear any gingos or anything. So, we're gonna get the fuck out. We're gonna geo out the D.O. Go out the dough. Alright. <laughs> it's actually something my friends say. Um, okay, we're gonna jump over here. Jump over here. And then, this is where extreme... Extreme tiredness comes from me. Alright. Hey there, Canary Mary. Why are you still around? <laughs> Oh, my wings are still a bit stiff from spinning so long in that cage. How about a race to help me stretch them? On this old mine cart, it was broken when I last saw it. It was, but I fixed it and put it back on the rail. You're pretty resourceful for an old bird, aren't ya? I like to try. Jump aboard if you fancy a go. Sounds like fun. What will you do? Simply tap A as fast as you can to drive the hand cart along. Oh, the hand cart. Yeah, that's what it is. Fuck. Stupid. All right. So basically, this is one of those like really stupid, repetitive races that we gotta do. Oh, what the hell just happened? Okay, I don't know. 